Unraveling the Mystery of Tychonoff's Theorem Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into an intriguing topic that lies at the heart of mathematics, particularly in the realm of topology. We're going to explore Tychonoff's Theorem, a cornerstone principle that has profound implications in various fields of study. Whether you're a student, a professional, or just a curious mind, understanding this theorem can open up a world of insight into the continuous functions and spaces around us. So, let's get started and unfold the layers of Tychonoff's theorem together. At its core, Tychonoff's theorem is about the nature of product spaces in topology. To understand this theorem, it's crucial to grasp two key concepts, topological spaces and product spaces. A topological space is a set of points, along with a structure that tells us how these points are arranged or related to each other. This structure allows us to talk about concepts like continuity and convergence. When we talk about product spaces, we're referring to the combination of two or more topological spaces to form a new space. Imagine taking two lines and combining them to form a plane. That's an example of creating a product space. Tychonoff's theorem boldly states that the product of any collection of compact topological spaces is itself compact. Compactness is a property that, in a sense, measures whether a space is finite in its extent or behavior, even if it contains an infinite number of points. The significance of Tychonoff's theorem cannot be overstated. It is foundational in topology because it provides a crucial link between compactness and the behavior of spaces when they are combined. This has implications not just in pure mathematics but also in areas like physics, computer science, and engineering. For example, in physics, compact spaces often model systems with finite energy. Thus, understanding how these systems behave when combined can be crucial for theoretical and applied physics. In the realm of computer science, compactness can relate to the efficiency of algorithms and their ability to handle large, complex data structures. To truly appreciate Tychonoff's theorem, it's essential to delve a bit deeper into what compactness and product spaces really mean. Compactness is a property that, in simple terms, allows us to handle infinite sets as if they were finite. It's a bit like being able to put an infinite number of points into a box without the box overflowing. Product spaces, on the other hand, allow us to construct new spaces that retain the properties of their components. This is akin to building a multi-layered structure where each layer retains its characteristics. I hope this exploration of Tychonoff's theorem has illuminated its significance and beauty. It's a theorem that connects seemingly disparate concepts and shows us the power of abstract thinking in mathematics. Whether you're tackling complex mathematical problems or simply marveling at the structure of the universe, Tychonoff's theorem offers a window into the intricate dance of continuity and compactness. Thank you for joining me on this journey, and I look forward to uncovering more mathematical mysteries together in the future. Happy learning!